Hey, good morning. It's a rainy Monday. And these babies are so sweet. <laughs> They're still so sleepy from their play day yesterday. Yeah, hi. Alright. I gotta go to work so you guys gotta take a nap, okay? <laughs> Alright. Put our jackets on because it's so rainy. Oh, don't they look so cute? We've got her. That's actually an Albert jacket. She's pooping. Sorry. Oh, you standing in the mud? That's a good idea. <laughs> oh, I love these babies so much. Happy rainy Monday. Good job, girl. Alright, everybody went in. I wanted to share this jacket. It's an L.L. Bean jacket. I really like it. Uh, my dad likes to go shopping on L.L. Bean and find deals and stuff. And so he found this. It was on sale like the end of the season, at the end of spring. So he got me and my sister and Nick and my niece these... Um, rain jackets and they are really really nice some rain jackets make you really hot and this one doesn't really do that plus they have lots of color options you don't have to get an obnoxious yellow color I just happen to like the obnoxious yellow color I feel like if you're wearing a rain jacket it should look like a rain jacket I don't know anyway I just wanted to share that LL Bean has some really good stuff so all right time to clean these wet little pups Hello and happy Tuesday. Feels like it should be later than Tuesday, but I think I say that every Tuesday. <laughs> um, I realized I didn't even check in this morning, but last week I had so much footage. I feel like I need to calm down with that because I don't really have that much going on during the week, so I'll just let you know if something comes up. But in any case, just wanted to say hi and happy Tuesday. This week at work is um, considered month end because it's the end of the month during this time. So this week I have to work extra long hours, which is fine. We get paid overtime, so I can't complain, but it's just going to be a long week. Uh, we did get free pizza today, so that's cool. <laughs> okay, so one thing I just wanted to say. It's not that important, but we did our ship shopper thing on Sunday and I tried to order some little mini drumstick like ice cream cones from Blue Bunny, I think they were, and they didn't have any. So she asked if we could substitute these Nestle drumsticks. And these are like really tiny, like that's the actual size apparently. Yeah. And it's kind of great because they're so little. I'll show you a real one. But there's so little, it's 70 calories for one cone, and one cone has seven grams of carbs. So if you're like into that kind of thing, watching that sort of thing, then that's really great. So like, look how little those are. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to share that in case you're on a low carb journey and you need some sort of treat. Because I know I did. Like the first week that was one thing I was like, I have to find treats that I can have because I just have to have something sweet sometimes, you know? Anyway, there's that. <laughs> I just had to run to the grocery because I was out of milk for coffee tomorrow. But we got these before I got them at Walmart and I went to Kroger tonight and saw them and decided to get them. These are the most amazing kiwi that I have ever tried. <laughs> Kiwis. Um, they are just so good. It's like eating candy. And they're, they come out not, not green like your typical kiwi. They, they come out a little more yellow. Oh man. 
but trust me, they're amazing. So, if you find these at your grocery store, just buy them, because they will be delicious. Now you know. <laughs> Good morning, it's Wednesday, August something. Mm. 28th, Wednesday, August 28th. Um, I was at work for like 10 minutes, and then I remembered I needed to go pick up my wedding dress. Yes, we're already married, but we're having like an actual wedding, a really tiny actual wedding uh, in February. So I'm going to see if they'll let me film for a video later, probably. <laughs> Just on the off chance that Nick would see it. I still want it to be a surprise. I think that'd be fun. Okay, so my appointment's at 10.30. It is 10.27, so I think I'll head up. be me. Okay, we're going up. Alright, so that went fine. I asked them to make a change to the dress and they didn't do that. But at this point I'm just kind of like, whatever. <laughs> they got the, the fabric is right. Whatever, it's all good. Whatever. <laughs> okay, I'm back at work now, so I'll check back in later. <laughs> okay, bye. All right, there it is, the dress. I'm curious how if you've gotten married and you have a dress and you picked it out and you were all excited, were you let down a little bit when you first put it on? Or were you like, oh my gosh, it's my perfect dress? I'm just curious. I don't know. I'm, I have odd feelings. I thought that I'd be like super gung-ho about it, but I'm just kind of like, meh. I don't know. Anyway, let me know what you what your experience was. If you went wedding dress shopping, or if you just bought like something off Amazon. Some uh, a bride that we just photographed their wedding. They, she got her dress from Amazon, and it was gorgeous. Anyway, so I don't know. Just let me know. Tell me your story. <laughs> I'd love to hear it. Okay, I'm gonna go see the babies and let them out. At lunch, it's the most gorgeous day ever. <laughs> Good morning, it is Thursday, August 29th, and we've done our morning routine. The babies went outside and went potty, had breakfast, I made coffee, and I thought I had it's 9:17 and I need to get going to work pretty soon, but I thought maybe I could do a quick little speed clean of something. There's two things. <laughs> this disaster area. I think I can get rid of this stand if I just clean it off. And we have these cabinets that I hate. They're like original to the house. And they're just kind of gross. Like this house was sitting empty for 10 years before anyone bought it and renovated it and we moved in so for whatever reason they left those cabinets and they're just old and kind of yucky so um yeah so there's that project I, I want to do and then I just want the room to be like a calming space and that drives me crazy so <laughs> I think if I just sort it and put stuff that I never see Nick wear in there, he can go through this at some point. And then I can get rid of this, send it to Goodwill, I can put my clothes away, and all will be right with the world. So I'm going to speed clean something. It might, it might just be these clothes because that seems like I can do that pretty quickly. So happy Thursday! <laughs> All right. 
Look how much nicer it looks in here. Also, lesson of the day, make sure that you actually press the button when you're trying to do a speed clean. Apparently I did not click the time lapse button. Had it set up, but it wasn't recording. So that's a bummer, but oh well. So much better. E. Why are you trying to mess up my fresh clean bed? Lay down if you want to. All right, so all the clothes that were here are now here and here and in these two drawers. And then I put Nick's softball stuff here because he uses that pretty often. I need to put these things away. Oh, nice. That's a good job. Yeah, you're good babies. So much better. Well, that only took like 30 minutes. It's 9.49. So like, yeah, right about 30 minutes. So, um, all right, I gotta get ready and go to work. But we accomplished that today. So that's good. We'll just have to do this disaster another day. Maybe tomorrow and I'll actually press the, <laughs> the button for the time lapse. Oh, anyway. Okay. Time to get ready. Yay, work. I was just about to head out and <laughs> I just wanted to mention that I'm very much ready for fall. Some of my friends on Instagram have been showing things like fall shirts. Bye babies, I love you. Some friends on Instagram were showing their early fall spirit and I don't think it's too early, so. All right, I'm going to work. Good morning, it's Friday, August 30th. And I just wanted to show you this beautiful necklace that I got. I ordered it on Etsy from Gilda Lane Jewelry I'll put her link to her shop down below but how pretty is that okay and it came in this really nice box with this sweet little note and I just love this looks like a travel case for your necklace how wonderful is that and then I had it personalized with Mary Nick Albert and Edie and she had little paw prints we could put on there and yeah, I love this necklace. I put it on immediately last night and uh, it was the easiest necklace I've ever put on. I think this little extra area right next to the clasp really helps with putting it on, but it was so easy. I love it. So cute. It has this little pocket so you can put earrings Oh, it's got like two pockets. That's neat. Wow, so cute. Definitely check out this shop, Gilda Lane Jewelry. Very happy. Um, I put it on so you can see. It's just a dainty little chain. I really like. I was actually on Instagram and saw an ad for like teardrop shaped stone necklaces, but they just had like a little rope string, and I prefer like a chained. So I feel like I can take a shower in this and stuff. And um, so in any case, I went from shopping on that ad to Etsy just because then I needed to find a necklace, obviously. <laughs> it's been a while since I've had like a permanent kind of necklace that I wear. And I don't know, I just like it. It makes me feel fancy. So um, I found this and ordered it. It's just so tiny, like I love it. It's not gonna be in the way or anything, in any case great shop um i love this necklace i love that you can personalize it because that just makes it a little more special you know otherwise it's just like a gold teardrop necklace but in any case okay i really have to go to work now um but it's friday and there's a three-day weekend so monday is labor day yay i'm hoping i can find a vacuum on sale a cordless vacuum because i really want one anyway okay must go <laughs> okay, I'll probably check in later. There's not that much going on today, but there's a three-day weekend, so that should be fun. Okay, I really will go now. Is this supposed to happen? 
they just got like this new guy and it flopped over and these guys are kind of flopping they feel kind of sturdy like that though <laughs> is this supposed to happen it doesn't look good so we have two people leaving the office today <laughs> one's going within the company and one is just leaving us so I decided to stop and get a cake I just crack myself up apparently it's like an internal joke whenever anybody's like signing off or leaving um, for the day we write like I am each other's hey bye <laughs> so anyway they're getting the K bye cake <laughs> There's the cake. Okay, bye. Goodbye. Okay, <laughs> bye. So this avocado toast was so good. It was perfect. And then we got the um, egg tart. Yeah. And it was okay. It was a little weird. <laughs> but, I don't know. This is like a mustard. I don't know. It was just interesting. The egg was kind of flavorless and mushy. But all the veggies on top kind of helped. Yeah, I don't know. This was definitely my favorite, and that. What's the trouble, sweet girl? What do you need? It's Sunday afternoon. Sorry, I'm throwing the ball. Uh, and we've pretty much just been chilling on the couch. Um, I've been working on some shirt things for Etsy, and I should have those up soon. I'll link my shop below so you can check it out. And if they're not up when this video goes up, then they will be up shortly. So I'm excited about that. That's really fun. Um, and yeah. There's not that much going on today. We're literally just sitting on the couch and I'm working on my computer. And <laughs> we just ordered some noodles and company. I usually get the lemon asparagus. And I'm trying a different one today. So, so exciting. I know. Yeah, I think I'm going to end this week vlog here. We didn't really do that much this week. Which might be nice for you guys to have a break with the long videos. <laughs> um, breakfast yesterday was so good. And we saw a really great friend as we were walking in, which was so, so unexpected and nice. Our friend Amanda, she's awesome. Anyway, so it is Sunday of Labor Day weekend, and this is what's happening. <laughs> no makeup, anything. We're just chilling today, so yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, and thank you so much. 
for watching. Um, if you like and subscribe, that would be awesome. I'd really, really appreciate it. And yeah, I will see you next week.